So, and we mm, here we go, Land of Dawn. Yes, we will just go into the Land of Dawn, into the first game of Battle 3 series. What will happen, we will just see. Gunflix and Wolf and Team B get thrown Alpha in the mid lane. Three heroes and four heroes, almost everyone is focusing on the mid lane. They want to win the lane because it will be hard for what to farm if they cannot win the mid lane. But Taka on the bottom lane, the, he got the minion. So yeah. almost surprise is popping everywhere. Ooh. Then Groot with a feather of and strike, he yeah. pop and make a deal damage that is so big. Alpha the Guardian coming oh from the Alpha. One to chase, That's one of Groot. Groot is down, but as well, mid Double cut. kill taken by Yishunshin, but what is also facing that one. He didn't manage to get out and managed to be shut down. Four heroes from Team Gambix are being shut down. Is it going to be this, the last one here, Clay? Blowing block right here, but Dream still manages his position. Is still coming oh, back. We get an alpha deeply, really fast right now. They are going to take just very deadly. Like yes. The, the damage from the Avatar of Guardian, the damage from Gatot Kacha, the damage from Rainbow with the Meteor Shower. It's just very painful to be taken and be handled. And things are over there. Focus on the bottom lane. Whether the strike is being popped by Groot, but no. They cannot uh, get Taka because he got Flicker. Is that he will get richer and he can be the counter of the Kitron Alpha. But there's no bowling the movement from Gamplex and Rowolf. They didn't let Gamplex and Rowolf have to Ooh. move, but look at that one. Whether it's like being popped up by the Guardian, making the mess up. The setup is doomed by Gamplex and Rowolf. They lose Fredo and Bikitron Alpha. The, the response is just too good to be true. And on the back side, oh, there is Clay with Blood. Oh, he popped up. Because Baitam Koopa will focus on him and it's it's gonna disturbing the move. Lost nothing. It's very good. It's very good. But yeah, this is the current stats for what and also Bruns uh, as the marksman as, as, or as the core. But look at this one actually. Fredo being chased by three members of Team Bigetron Alpha and uh -oh. Clay. Yes, with the falling blood, he ran away. He cannot compete with Bigetron Alpha on the network. It's just a huge, it's almost 6,000? Six, six, six almost 7, eh? Yeah, almost 7,000 gold. So, right now, Alpha got it again and again. Everyone can dodge it, but oh no, the Meteor Shower is just too pain. And has Bigetron Alpha. They are trying to get the inhibitor. Complex and Rowoff is in danger. Oh, so much pressure from... So the Meteor Show is not the main, the main power of the... It's too scary, oh, wow. no rainbow! Oh my god, the Meteor Show or cooldown is just too fast. Yeah, it's very fast, especially if you're making over the... Day. But yeah, we can see the item right here. If we can see over the Alice, is making over Winter Trunket as a glowing one. But Chang Yi already having glowing one and with oh, ice cream one. What, what kind of sorcery that he have? So yeah, he will be... Very rich. And look at that one. Bruns oh, just got one point kill. It's so different with Gran Alpha. Yeah. Got 10 point kill. And right now it will be 11 because Fredo Fredo. cannot take that much damage. Movement from Team Gambix Tower. Okay. Rainbow! <laughs> giving wow. a bit shower, but Groot is still surviving with that. Oh no, he still Bravo. survived. Yes, it, but Rainbow is by Mandiri. Lord is here in the land of Dawn. First Lord of the game. Yes, and this is the first slot that can be taken by Bigetron oh. Alpha, but look at that one! Fredo is down, Taka with a lot of white blood right now. He is so brave with the Falling Star Moon. The initiation is just too good, and Bigetron Alpha, they are not wasting any time. They move into the Lord, and now Alpha Tarum Guardian is stopping Brit from the Feather oh, Strike hell. again, but Clay is trying to steal the Lord. One more bar, the Lord being what? slain, who will get what? the Lord, and the what? Lord is taken by Gamblex and Rowoff. Still survive. Clay is all low, but Winter can can help him. Mid God is running away because there is nobody in here. Rainbow Meteor Shower. Oh, uh oh. Mid God can dodge it really well, but what is being taken by Biggest Run Alpha? Almost wiped out and Lord spawn with no.
nobody beside him. Oh my God, but that is a really, really scary war. Like you see, what is forcing? Uh, they make something as a mid card alone in the bottom lane, chase by Taka and Brands trying to dodge everything. But Federation strike will pop up. Kill Free Zero, they want to cover Midgard on the bottom lane, but oh. Falling Star Moon got nobody in there. And right now, Avatar of Guardian oh. getting into the grid to survive with the flicker, but on the back side, with Blood of Clay alone, with nobody helping him. And no, two heroes from Kill Free is done. It's being three, and we get on Alpha getting a lot of advantage that's right now. Radio is alone, being used by Flicker, but no, Radio. Taka or oh Taka, look at Taka. Taka doesn't care about anything. He just wants to dance. He just wants to dance. Look oh. at that Esmeralda. He's holding everything. He's frost moon shield. And look at this one. Actually, they try to end the game. The base is not gonna be taken by Big Alpha without any hesitation. But Monster Kill be taken by the Browns before they're closing the first game of on with the Pentam Execution. It's gonna be a very, very easy pick off coming from Smash Team Big Alpha. So, Gatron Alpha, they want to play early, but Genfix are off. They want definitely Welcome. to play okay. late. So here we go. Second game of the series between Big Gatron Alpha and our home team, Genfix are off. They need a lot of EVO to win this game because they already lost one point on the game one. And right now, we've got in the bottom lane and Taka on the top lane. There. All of the Malden side been taken away, uh, been given to the Esmeralda, so Esmeralda cannot do a lot, but Rainbow is now the target! Oh first my god, blood. he will be the first blood for Gameflix, I swear Rainbow is directly making over the penetration shoes, but maybe he, because he wants to rush to have the level 4, yes. First, before he is having the room item. But Dream side. No, he still survived. Nobody gets hurt in the mid lane, but on the top lane. Because on Alpha will lose their first two red. Oh my god, mid cut is being chased right now. With the Koopa mid cut on the bus, he still survived and he's running away. But on the turtle side, oh, oh so fatally coming from Gamblix and Robo. But the things is screwed down. Clay is so low and flick away. He's just survived. Five. But oh, falling star moon! He does everything from beginning on. All but Thornrus, uh, the last Thornrus cannot be touched by Clay and Clay. Exactly. But he's only having one kill while mm -hmm. Rainbow is also having another one. So in the top lane right here, we are seeing Inverno oh. being opened by Taka. But the <laughs> damage from if he forces it is gonna be really bad idea. But Phantom Execution now is on Bronze hand, and Bronze already having his Heptasis. If he combos it with the Raptor Machete, it's just well, gonna be very well. peaceful. Oh my <laughs> god, Camp Litero, whoa! Uh, meanwhile, Midgard got three kills. Oh, the turtle right now, they're moving to the next objective. But Camp Litero don't want it left oh. alone. Midgard giving a lot of damage right here, but he will be punished, I think. But Lancelot managed to get one kill. Bravo as well. Here, they're gonna chase oh there is uh their friends here brands is cutting uh, the mid cut and say goodbye to mid cut the punishment is oh uh, there is play with the falling star moon dream is so low and flick Taka. away getting one point kill two point kill and say goodbye to Taka. is brands is safe but brands is not as powerful as i thought it will be and look at this one brands is actually giving a lot of damage fatally being open but the blue buff is secured by Clay right here. Brands is need to go away, but he couldn't. There is no escapability from Brands, and he's being shut down at that moment. But Bravo, Bravo and Clay. Actually, if you're facing Atlas, you have to hit out any contest, so they're going to secure it. But Alma's being opened by uh, Dream, so the, they will trigger the disable from the Popo Koopa. Oh, oh, but Fredo, he flicked away. He didn't want to get in fight, but Midgard on the back side, he's alone, and Phantom Execution just pop up by Brands and Sekil Unity coming right on the mid lane, and everyone just melts and Bravo is being taken down, but Groot with a flicker cannot escape wow. from front. Phantom Execution shutting down the Groot, but on the other side, Brand is still survive. Phantom Execution, Torn Rose, everything he used. That's what I'm scared of. 
Here's what I'm scared of, but Ooh. this one. Now the Phantom is Christian from a bronze bed, the kill coming from a rain bed. And Midgard is here, being it on over. They really need to be careful. Yeah. Their position is not really good because the rest of the team gets back off is coming to that direction. And they are coming from the backside. It's easily getting zoned out by the team Gigatron Alpha, but who will get the load? That's what's important right here. Oh, and move on right now on the backside. The Bravo is being taken down. I mean, well, the Lord is so low, and no, Lord is being taken by Ganflix Arrow up. Nice play by Ganflix. But the problem is, because on Alpha, they lose Brunts in this state. It's kind of hard for them to secure or defense the mid turret on oh the first god. tire. Oh my god, they got the Lord, they got everything, oh and look at that. Why mid god is very painful, but Taka still holding it with the Inverno, but Clay, look at Clay! Clay just gonna dance it away. Clay's just gonna dance it away, but Kogyo Mogyo saved the day. Yep, yep, ah. yep, and almost the uh, Abyssal Arrow hit perfectly to Taka, but Taka still managed to touch it, and yeah, I think Falling Star Moon, Clay open just to make a surprise, but Gamflex Arrow, Lord is coming to... Uh, hero from the Gamflex Arrow. No, they can maybe using the purple Hoopa and try to clear it, but Brands is gonna be shut down, I think! Yeah, and they're moving to the top lane, and you know, uh, Bunky Shield unit being open. Midgard is coming to wow. the back line, but the damage from Bigger Alpha is just too big. And the turret just being taken by Gamflix and Rawwolf. Oh, oh, oh. They lose Midgard. They need to get back and reset the war. Reset the war, and Fredo is got beaten by Poopa right here. But Clay, where are you going? Where are you going? The most second. Gearfix Arrow is the one that's leading, but look at the damage coming from Rainbow. It's very huge, even though he is getting shut down after the of what first before they're jumping into the war. That's what they need. But Ooh. the fatal link, oh no, it's not connected to anyone. Yep, the beauty vice is too good, but on the back side, there is a Bravo moving to crew. They want to take the back line from Gamfix Arrow, but it's not enough. And the Phantom is increasing the damage, it's just too big from Mikita Nova. Wow. being taken down, and Clay is the only Star Moon going to Dreams, and Dreams going back, letting Koopa hit the Clay alone, and three heroes from Mikita Nova are down. Oh my god, three members of Bigatron Alpha are done. This is the momentum of Genflix Arrow. This is 15 minutes already. This is the hard game already for Bigatron Alpha. But what will happen? Oh, Falling Star Moon. Again and again, Taka holding all everything alone with the Inferno that he pop up right on the mid lane. Wow. Midgard is really low, but Genflix Arrow wants to take this game. And he will be in the mid lane, being taken down by Genflix Arrow. The minion is coming to the base. One hero at least from Bigatron Alpha. But look at Ray. Uh, with the perfect match, they open the map and the Klee is opening from Dream side with Bravo, Bunchy Shield, Unity. What are he looking for on the back line? Oh, oh, but uh, Groot is trying to run away. Bronze is really low, he's alone with the Phantom Mexicans and it's just not enough to take anyone down. And Fredo, uh, oh, uh, Rainbow, no. Rainbow is down on the back line. What is really low as well, but Bravo cannot taste. Please. Oh, 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 what is still survive? Bravo! is really low right now he need to get back as soon as possible but there is taka taka still holding the momentum right here from Genfix and Rolof. he's using the molten side just to push them away but the lord is gonna be taken by Genfix and Rolof since what oh, is whoa, whoa, whoa. to do the solo lord alone? <laughs> solo lord alone but how about his base how about your base oh oh Okay, he didn't want to get the... Maybe they, want, they don't uh, want to... They just want to be yeah. careful and... More secure. More secure to yeah. the game number two. And Three. again, please and roll with the Lord coming to the base of Victor and all that. Clay is coming to the bottom lane with the what but Falling Star Moon. Bronze. Nobody gets into the Falling Bata Star Moon. Link managed to get Bronze on it. Maybe he will be shut down right then. But Phantom Execution being used and managed to get Selena. Yep, and Lord is still there. What is still survive? Man, nobody gets hurt. Only Groot, who is left up with a die bed. Because of all. Wow! wow. It will be the longest game for a professional. The longest game of the day. Yes.
But look at this one, actually, me got dealing a lot of damage to one press, but France managed to get out by the bit of execution. Yep, me got almost his never win up, and more and more, because all by trying to chase down everyone on Gambling's Airball. There is no Fatal Link by Fredo, and he can pick off some hero from Genfix Arrow, it's gonna be super dope for the Gator Alpha. Yep, and we can also want to get Play. one point kill before the Lord coming and Brahms, he got uh, Immortality, he got blue buff, he got a red buff, Brahms is ready to fight. Soon. Okay, this is the Lord. Lord, second Lord, is coming to the land of Dawn by the Mandiri Lord Cam right here. Mm -hmm. Um, Rainbow. Rainbow also dealing a lot of damage because of the clock of the Sunni. Lacking Trunk Count is very good for late game. But uh -oh. Clay versus Taka. Taka Taka? Taka Darumba. But he got the Immortal Lady, so Clay will chase down the Taka. No, he don't want to waste the time to chase Taka because there's Lord coming right in front of them. Galvex are off. They want to take the first shot of the Lord. What with Groot, they're focusing, but Bravo! Fungi Shield Unity. He already got the information, but on the backside, oh, Clay is holding everyone from Big Eton Alpha. Bite them, Kopa, bite them, Kopa, but help them, Kopa. D, they are not gonna be too. Oh, Fatali, but being open already. And we got yes, our uh, Rainbow is in danger, but Midgard being taken down first, and Fredo is being left behind. We get on Alpha, they give a lot of pressure. Right now, Genfix are all want to reset because they lose a Midgard. They need Midgard. Oh my god, they need Midgard because Midgard was almost killing the Kagura. But look at that one, Groot. Inverno being popped out right here by the Thomas. What will happen? Fredo is the one that be. They are chasing. They are still using the bite them, Kupa, but they are holding it up. Yes, after Genfix are all of this Midgard right now, uh, the chance for Big on Alpha to take the Lord down is so huge. Okay, but Esmeralda is pushing the wave in the mid uh -oh, lane right uh -oh. here. It's gonna be very huge. Rainbow is really here. nearby. Okay, they're just gonna be not uh -oh. focused because of that one. And the Lord is still hauled by the Genfix arrow. Oh my god. I uh -oh. thought it's gonna be resetted, but it's not. They're just gonna continue the Lord right here. Only two bar and half. Two bar and half. What will happen? Who will be kidnapped? Who will be mm. taken? Who will be taking the Lord? But the Lord is being, being reset. reset. Yes, but Bravo, they lose Bravo. We got all battling, nice battling with three heroes right now. Phantom is being being bye by Brands is alone right now. And Brands. Oh, where is Brands? Brands is running to the top lane alone. Immortality is being banished and Brands. Goodbye, Brands. Oh, this is gonna be the end yes. of the game. We thought Lord Kangfix and Wolf can win this game. But, yes, they're gonna, gonna end the second game from Team Kangfix and Robo. So we will go to. The the I don't know. I, I think Harit will have the. Momentum of the early and late game, but we, we don't we don't know. The, we, we are forgetting that one is you know what? Organ flicks. Yeah, that, that, that's right. Yeah, we are forgetting uh, oh that. Yeah. <laughs> that stuff. We are just focusing on the draft, right? Yeah, the question. Uh, uh, yeah, that's a surprise question from you. <laughs> but if we go like the early stage from Big one is they are so strong. Uh, if wait. they want to. But Whoa! Genflix playing aggressive towards the One big more. of Fredo. Oh no, Flicker! And Brian's okay. just uh, dodged uh, the the kill from Fredo, but why not Fredo is in danger? With the soon fall, where will he go? Oh no, Fredo cannot go anywhere because we got to red first to red, but Fredo, look at the aggressive play from Fredo. Oh, he disrupt anyone on his side. Yeah, he disrupt anyone on his side, but Groot here. Trying to disturb the blue buff again. They, they are not Fredo. letting. Oh, but the summon force being open. Fredo is down and on the backside, falling summon being up. Uh, oh, well, everyone is so low, but can't play with the Lunox playing really aggressive and playing really uh, good stable. Uh, oh, oh. But Fredo managed to kill someone, even though that he's being punished by the Esmeralda, Saka. And the other still level seven. Taka is seven. Rainbow is seven. Nobody Brands can is seven. Yes, and look at the hurricane then chasing down alone Fredo. But on the top lane, Taka is alone. There's level eight. Two levels behind. Mm -hmm. 
He's having a good time, but Yuri Gandans right now getting play away without any destruction. And Gambling and Robo, they're scattered around Fredo up to taunting. And Victor and Alpha just want to shut Fredo down with the Yuri Gandans. And after that, everything just being pop up. So Fredo is going to run away with the flicker. And is he still surviving? No. With the they just give everything they got for you. Yeah, and it's 3 7. Actually, Gambling Soul only get three kills, but dreams. Opening his ultimate, but he got nothing at all, no one at all. And Bravo is running away with a dragon for him. He is trying to save his life and mid cut with the Inferno. He is trying to focus on the turret as well. They don't want to be so uh, ever exaggerated. Yeah. And Fredo with the recall, recall. Oh, but they didn't get any turret from Kamisawa and Whale Striker. Oh. Again, Fredo alone. Just to get a rainbow, and that's all. But what here coming to follow up the war right here? And look at that falling star moon being dodged away, and Yin and Yang connect. Black from Dragon coming here from Bravo. Try to catch up over Clay, but we got uh, got two, two kills here. Got double kill, but look at that one. They are all almost dead, and no, because it's uh, the wheel Dragon die. Fredo has already opened up before the war, and. Yeah, whoa, the play is down. I don't know, the fight is Bro, everywhere. Oh, Look at wow. the what with the 10k network. He's and so rich. And actually, the Roscoe Meteor onto the mid god makes him more brave. Oh, but look at that one. Surprise. Actually, the follow up to the mid lane right here. Focus to get over the outer, last outer to rest, but Fredo! Oh no, Falling Star Moon is touched by everyone from Genshin Robo. Bravo! Being a dragon form, but nobody can. And only mid cut with being the victim. But because on Alpha, they swap Bravo and mid cut. Oh, why he, he got caught in a surprise? <laughs> surprise attack! Oh. And he's not just being left behind. Mother Shagger being popped up, but look at the bad fist being popped up. It's not enough to track Gambling's Arrow Wolf. That one a surprise attack from Gambling's Arrow. But the Rigor, 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 from still have more penetration. He wants to penetrate it easier to get on Alpha's uh, oh armor. Oh my god, oh. this is the spirit that we see, want from the see team. See that one? Sanguine Glow and Bad Impact. See that Red? one? It's almost died. <laughs> <laughs> but really? Oh, trying to hold it and cutting the minion, but... Oh no! <laughs> the and also usual. Best yes. counter. And Meanwhile, Lord is being taken by Kenrisaro really yeah. fast. And Wave Dragon right to Dreams. Here we can dance just to make mm. a defensive assault. But where is Groot going? Oh no! Uh -oh. No. Where are you going? No. Yeah. In FPL season 6. Wow. Maybe they will be able to clear this game. But I don't know. Look at that one. Fredo jumping to the front. And Black Dragon from just getting popped up. But Bravo is not. Enough, Fredo is down, but mid card is really low. And mega kill getting from Rainbow. Oh, it's a disaster from Gamblix and Robo. Or 300 stack really? at this moment. Yeah. Supposed to be 300, <laughs> more, 300 stack, but Dreams <laughs> managed to get Groot and one bad impact. Know how to zone them out. And with this kind of whoa, Wave Dragon being open again, Dreams. It's too fast. Here again, then scouting on the back side. But look at Groot. Groot cannot go anywhere with the flicker that he got. He even cannot pop up the flicker. But what are you doing, Gambler? Gain in this cruel word. And Zaman Horse being popped up by Brian's Corno Dash and going everywhere that he wants. Fredo. But Fredo is real low. He's cutting the Brian alone. But it's not that. Oh, wow! Oh! The Lord is taken by Team Bigatron Alvlord. So 22 minutes already. If they can clear the Lord, and because they have the the Yishun Sheen, and I believe they can do it, uh, it's gonna be very hard. But the Black from Dragon being open right here by Bravo tried to jump in, falling Star Moon tried to get over Fredo, but Fredo buying the time. Oh no! And still right there alone, Fredo immortality is going. He got no flicker, but. Oh, individual on the mid lane is being exposed because of Alpha. They have a chance to win this game. What a waste from Gambling's Arrow if they lose this game. But Bravo, Whoa. he's taken down by Gambling's Arrow. He's been taken down. Maybe another one will be taken down as well. Look at this one. They're trying to go and teach them away. But Rats will be killed by them. 
and Groot. They're just gonna go for over Rainbow and Rainbow with the Winter Trucker. They're just not gonna let him go. And he will be shut down just like that. Along with Taka on their hands. What will happen next, Cyclone Eye? Cyclone Eye chasing Taka and Taka kills a soul. Zemis is so, so powerful. Taka Taka Rumba. And for heroes from Vigaton Alpha is done right now. Can we get an elbow? Is merging down to the base of Vigaton Alpha. That's the power of Luigi. That's the power of the Luigi. The teleportation giving the element of surprise. I and who can defend this one? Focusing on the base or Dream Sorry to oh. uh, do uh, <laughs> something. But no, 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 no. no. It's a wipe out. Oh, Say goodbye to Vigaton Alpha. Congratulations! Oh, Finally! Can we arrow wolf? They are winning the Come game number three. Oh, wind. If I had no, had no. That.